Hello, Cup Coders, and welcome back to Ars Magica 2 Wizard Training. Alright, now, just a quick recap. As always, I went into the nether last time. We got three blaze rods. Um, unfortunately, it took so long to go and get those blaze rods, I don't remember what I wanted them for. I know, right? I don't have a clue. I've totally forgotten what I wanted them for. But I do know... Now, we are in desperate need of some armor because, well, I had some of this made, apparently, and we lost it. So, we need to make this, the boots, and the chest plate. That is right. Now, to make this, let's see, we got we got some stuff going on here. I got, okay, basic stuff over there, Smolten. We're good. Hold on. A little scatterbrained today. Don't mind me. Okay, here we go. Here's the first thing. To make that, I need to make one of these first. And we need to take that out and throw it in the smelter. Smelter. Which, by the way, they are already working, cooking up some food. As you see here, some chicken. Boom, we'll get that cooked. That should give us two purified Ventium dust, which is just about what we need. Let's see, then we got this. We need air essence on there, I think. And we need the earth essence there. So we're going to grab this and this. What am I doing? What am I doing? Those, that'll make the air essence along with that stuff that's out there. Oh, what did I need that other two for? Hold on. Ooh. Why did I cook six pieces of smooth stone? I don't remember. Oh, man, I'm horrible at this. Hold on. You're still smelting? You were just one. A little more. A little more. Almost done. Bring it on, baby. God, hey, we got an extra one. Okay. So back we go. Let's go get the air essence. We're just going to try to run them all at one time and get them all done. So I think it was the air essence. I was pretty sure there was something we needed fire essence for. And that was the reason we were going into the nether. But I don't remember what it was. So I don't think it was that. I don't think it was that. Eh, we'll work on it later. See? Bad memories. I don't have any memory. We put one of these in the center. Back out and look at it again. Okay, that is cooking. Let's go take a look at the compendium. Hi. How did you get out? Well, that's not a good enough answer. I mean, you're supposed to be in the fence. Well, I, I, it, it's not big enough, huh? Not big enough for you, huh? Is that what it is? Get your butt back in that fence. Get in there. In, in you go. In you go. In, in, in. Jimmy Christmas. Now, stay in the pen. It's safe in the pen. Don't you understand that? Jeez. All right, check the compendium. Hold on. We're one thing leads to another. Forget everything we're doing. Hold on. Battle mage armor. Let's see the boots. Needs air essence. Okay, we've got that going. Leggings. Oh, that needed to fire. How do I? When did I make the fire essence? Oh, okay. Never mind. That, that's not what. It, so that's not what it needed. It anyways. Hmm. That means there must have been something else that I wanted to make. That required that. Hold on. We got calefactors. We have an essence refiner. We have inscription tables. We have inlays. We have magic walls. We have magician's workbench. We have the oculus. We have the reconstructor. So we have everything we've already unlocked. Okay. So it must be something we don't already have. Blocks, crystal pillar, desert nova. No, essence conduit, everstone, lectern. Oh, we've already made lecterns. Pull that back. Aha! Uh -huh. Negative. Nothing. Nothing that we haven't already made. So, all right. Well, you know, that's okay. There are other stuff that we do need, like some of these sigils. I want to make. I want to make start making some sigils. Like we've got those guys out there that are just chilling out there in the garden. Uh, specifically, the cows and the chickens. They're more important to me right now. So we want. I think it's progeny. Okay, so we need 
So this is what we're going to work on. We're going to work on making a sigil of progeny. See if we can remember. We need six eggs, two white runes, and a life essence. Oh, that's not going to be hard to make. No, not at all. Okay. So let's start, start with the eggs. All right. How many eggs y'all got in there now? I know, I just had to come and kill one of y'all after I breeded you. I'm sorry, but uh, I need the eggs. No, I am not making an omelet. Don't worry about it. No, they will not be bred. All right, let's check the chest downstairs. Let's see if we got any in, in the, the mob drop chest. You never know. Okay, so we have four eggs. We need two more eggs from those chickens. Okay. Oh, wait, we need more than that, don't we? Because we needed two more for the life essence. So we still need four more eggs. Oi, oi, oi. All right, so we need light. Oh, wait, wait, wait. While we're in the mob drop chest, we need some of this. Give me one more bone, please. Thank you. I need two of those because we need white. Yeah, white runes. That's it. Drawing a blank. So we need two white runes. Two white runes. And I just happen to see two more eggs in there. So now we still only need two more eggs. Whoa. All right, so rolling back, we'll come. We'll work with that one later. Uh, all right, no, wait, wait, wait. Let's do the life essence first. We need two apples. Do we have apples? Any apples in here? No. Any apples in here? We have two apples. There we go. We have four apples actually. We need two pieces. We need gold to go around that. I think. Wait, wait, wait. Yeah, I'm pretty sure that was gold nugget apple. I know in newer versions of Minecraft, you still can't. You can't make. Dude, I am low on... It better be the golden nugget apple, I'm telling you. We don't have a whole lot of gold there. Alright, so... Oh, boy. Oh, boy. Um, I don't think I have enough gold. We're going to have to go mining for gold. Because we definitely do not have enough gold. That sucks. Death Royal sucks, man. Let me tell you. Mm. Sorry, I'm being quiet. I thought I heard somebody come running up my stairs. Wasn't sure. Not the stairs in the house here, but the stairs in the real world. Okay, well, we can't make the life essence because we don't have the golden apples. We don't have enough gold to make the golden apples. We need to go mining for the golden apples. So here's what we're going to do. We're going to bring this right down here. And we're going to get the recipe started right here. So now we know we need life essence there. I really need to install bibliocraft. That's what I need. I need bibliocraft because then I can make a checklist. Yeah. That's what I'll do. All right. So for next episode, I need to install Bibliocraft into this episode so that we have something to play with. Yeah. Then I'll have, you know, checklists and stuff. All right. Well, anyways, for now, there's that. We need life essence there. And to make that life essence, I'm going to need two apples, one arcane ash, and two eggs. So... Let's go ahead and throw the one arcane ash in the center because we know it doesn't do anything. Oh, so there. There we go. And let's go see if we can't collect the other two eggs. Hey, guys. I could really use a couple eggs. Um, and you could really get out of that corner. God, I wish they'd fix that crap. That is so fucking annoying. That's right. Call your local sofa dealer. Ask to speak to the king and tell him he's annoying. Because that's what that is. Blah. All right. We need some eggs. Hurry it up. Hurry it along, please. Hurry along. I promise we won't watch. We'll walk away. Give you some privacy. Oh, we're not looking. We're not looking. Hold on. Oh, oh, oh. Oh, they see us. Ah. Oh. Okay, well. 
do, 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 do. We'll just throw these right on in here for now. We know that we need two eggs. We know that we need enough gold to turn those into golden apples. Blah. Uh, what else were we working on? Oh, yeah. Hold on. Check the furnace. Check the furnace. Nothing there. Oh, steak. Yeah. Ooh, wait. No, over here. All right, we have the earth essence. Ding, ding. Um, okay. Doo -doo. Had to remember, brain fart, you know. All right, that'll work. Doo -doo -doo. Just watching the magic pull in. Still going. Well, let's go check out what else we got going here. Hold on. I know this episode is it, we're just kind of running around back and forth. I haven't really done a whole lot. But uh, boom, there's there's our armor. We are almost there. We are now. We just have shoes. We're walking around in bare feet right now. So we just need to make our shoes. That is empty. We're good there. So the, just the shoe recipe there, and then this is our, our thing for later. Oh, while we're doing that, we're going to need one of these. Oh my god, look! Gold again! Wow! Yeah, okay, so that sucks. Hmm. Well, I guess we might as well go ahead and make the sigil stand, because we only need one for the progeny thing. So it just means we have to get a lot more gold. Well, at least a little bit more gold. Yeah. Right, so that's three. So that means we need five more pieces of gold ingots. Oh, wait, no. Eight. Then we need, oh, 13. We need 13 more golden bars in order to make the two golden apples that need to go for this recipe. You guys suck. Royally. Um, you know, I still have this stone, and I have no idea why I collected it, but that's okay. We'll use it anyways. There is our sigil stand. So we have the sigil stand. I'm just going to leave it right there because that don't... Well, no, 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 no. Hold on. Uh, we'll put it over here. We'll put the sigil stand right there because that'll remind me that hey, this is for a sigil, and then we can look it up and see which sigil it was. If I forget, you know, which I'm probably will. I'm likely to do that, you know. All right, we still need two apples, two eggs. Hey, I just need one more. Oh, thank you, thank you, thank you. Oh, right, let me come and get it. Let me come and get it. Stop telling me no. I'm not listening to you. Sheesh. Now, I have noticed something, and I'm going to point this out, but I have not seen any enemies. So here's what we're going to do. Now, this is a known issue with Ars Magica. I think I've shown it to you before, and I've talked about it, and I really, I think I should have, I mentioned that I was going to try to fix it, and I still haven't done that. So here's what we're going to do. We're going to go to options. We're going to change peaceful. Wait a few seconds. Now, most people say wait a whole day, but in all honesty, you don't have to wait a whole day. You just have to wait a few seconds for the for the, the game to clear out all the monsters. For some reason, it doesn't recognize Hecate as monsters until you turn peaceful on. It's weird. I know, but that's what it is. All right, so now we're back on hard. We're gonna go hunt. Might as well. I mean, what else are we doing? I mean, I do have to go gold mining. Maybe some of these guys will give us gold. And don't worry, I'm just gonna hit you with the weakest spell I have. Whoa, 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 whoa. No, whoa. 
Power it up now. At this power level, I don't want to miss. Ah, oh, there I go missing. I say that I don't want to miss, and then I miss. That you see how that works? Hey, where you? Where, where'd you get that shovel? Did, did, I mean, you can keep it. You can keep it. I mean, I just wanted to know where you got it. Look, you're holding it over your shoulder like it's a rocket launcher. What are you gonna shoot him? Gonna shoot a dirt clot at me next? I have a feeling somebody's coming up behind me. Hold on. Go get that experience. I want that experience. Bring it here. Ooh, don't hit that lava. Don't walk into the lava, man. Oh yeah, don't fall down there. Somebody fall down the hole. And they go splat at the bottom. Hey guys, wanna follow me? Come on. Jump on in. Promise, it's okay. Come on in here. Water's fine. <laughs> hmm. You know what? Let's go on down. We need gold. Perfect place to look for it. All the way down here. But actually, I want to come up a little bit because this is right down at bedrock. As you can see, there's the bedrock. So I want to come up a few levels and dig around there. Oh, wait. Look. Right there. Hold up. Oops. Power it up. Grab that gold there, buddy. Thank you. Ooh. Let's move this out of the way. I don't need this. Let's move that out of the way. I really don't need that on my bar. All right. Let's. I don't need that on my bar either. All those holes in. I don't like them. Yeah. Any more gold around here? I see iron. Yeah, all kinds of other stuff. Oh, wait. Nope. That's iron. Iron, 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 iron. All right, well, we're going to go up in this here. I think this brings us up to about 16 or 12. And that's where I want to dig. Yeah, 13. That's perfect. Power it up. In reality, when you're playing this, I'm, I'm gonna let you know now. I have a bad habit, and this is this is a very bad habit. I'm gonna teach you what this habit is, and maybe if I teach you the habit that I do, you might not do it. Okay? Here's the habit, and you, I'm sure some of you have noticed this, but as I'm digging, I'll do this. Pop. Oh wait. Pop. And I'll continually dig without paying any attention to my burnout. That, my friends, is a bad habit. You don't want to do that. And the reason is, the higher your burnout level is, the more expensive your spell is going to be. Okay? So you definitely want to, you really should maintain that burnout. And by maintaining it, here's what I'm talking about, all right? So in maintaining the burnout, I'm going to power up my spell and dig that seven, what, what is that, seven? Five by five region right there, okay? Shoot once, wait for the burnout to drop before you shoot again. That really is the best way to do this. I mean, if, if you want to be down here for long periods of time and not have to worry about stopping for... You know, for super long periods of time to wait for your mana to regen, then you need to let that burnout drop down. It really doesn't take that long. It's just, it is a little time consuming. And the higher the level you are, the faster that burnout is going to drop down because the less it's going to go up. Some light down here. Iron. I'm not having any luck finding gold, man. You need a lot more gold. So as you see here, what I do is, you know, I'm impatient. I just plop it out, pop it out. I just pop it out one over and over again. And I don't really pay too much attention to my burnout. And as a result, I end up running out of mana a heck of a lot faster. And then I'll, just, I'll have to sit here a lot more than if I waited for my burnout to, to drop down. That's a bad habit on my part. Hold on, take a drink of my beer. 
Yes, you heard that right. I am recording while I'm drinking today. This is Friday night. I normally record on a Saturday night. Friday night is my drinking night. But we are... Well, let's say Saturday night. We're going out. We're going to, Saturday night. Saturday around five o'clock. We're going to a wedding, and then Sunday morning, approximately about seven a.m. or earlier or later, well, it depends. We're going to be getting up, piling into the car, and taking a nice long drive. I think it's supposed to be like an eight-hour drive from here in Knoxville, Tennessee. Over to Lakeland, North Carolina. Not Lakeland, sorry, sorry. Um, <laughs> White Lake, North Carolina. Is it put it correctly? It's a nice place. It's uh, a little lake that was created by Meteor a long, long time ago, and so it's fresh water because the meteor came down and hit a spring or something like that. At least that's what I've been told. And so the water is, you know, it's fresh water. It's not very deep. I think at the deepest it's probably like maybe maybe 10 feet at the most and i think that's i, I really do think that's pushing it being honest with you what have we got so far we got three pieces of gold or we really need to step this up man am i just looking in the wrong level for gold ore or something i mean i mean obviously i'm in the right level for diamonds hold on well, that's not diamond is that diamond yeah, I think that is diamond. Hold on. That is diamond. I will definitely take that diamond. And because there was a diamond here, hold on. Got the power. That is why I do that. Um, whoop. Oh, shut up. Random sounds in Minecraft. <laughs> right, plop, plop. Now, just to keep it even, I'm going to go ahead and plop this back in. Hold on. Hold on. Just like this. And that's also to make sure I don't fall down that hole again. <sighs> don't want to do that. Uh, we're going to leave that right there, I guess. There's no sense filling all of it in. And let's keep digging. Just keep digging. Let's take a Dory from the Dory. Yeah, Dory from uh, ooh, Finding Nemo. Stupid gravel, man. All right. I see that mage light comes in handy because now I don't have to worry about you know running out of torches or going back upstairs for torches or for wood to make torches. That's what being a wizard is all about: making things easier. Now, of course, there's a lot easier that we could probably be doing stuff like this, um, but hey, whatever. And I'm not concerned about picking up the cobble because I'm just going to throw most of this cobble into the lava. I've already collected way too much cobble. I don't think I'll ever use it unless I come up with some large build that I want to do on this show. Which, believe me, I am trying to come up with something. I don't know. I'm not that great at large builds. So, just so you're... Just, just to warn you, I'm not really good at large builds. But I am going to try to come up with something. But I can't guarantee anything, so, you know, don't keep your hopes up, put it that way. But I'll try, yeah, I'll, I'll, I'll see what I can come up with, you know. Maybe a mage tower, like some kind of a wizard's fortress or something, I don't know. Right. I hear lava nearby. Lava's not good. Oh, I don't just hear lava, I hear zombies. There's a zombie. Hello, zombie. Oh, wait, I'm hungry. Hungry, hungry, hippo. Alright, well, we've got three things of gold and not much else. Hmm. Oh. Waiting on the mana, because you saw I just cast, cast, cast with no pain, not paying attention to the burnout. 
And we might want to stop casting for a minute because it looks like, oh, we just found the lava. And hi. Oh, we're out. Kind of hard to fight a bunch of zombies when you don't have a weapon in your hand that works. Eh. Got him, got him. All right, well, let's go ahead, and we're going to head on up, and let's get rid of all this cobble first before we go up there, but we're kind of running out of time here, and we have not accomplished everything I wanted to do, but we're going to go ahead and dump this stuff and head up and kind of get organized real quick. Let's see. We don't need that. I don't need that. I don't need the cobblestone. I don't need that. Let me just dump this on, on out there. You know what I really need to do? I thought I just saw a chicken. Weird. Uh, what I really need to do is I need to put a hopper and a chest right here. That way I can just put everything into the chest and it'll drop it out into the lava for us. Wouldn't that be awesome? Actually, I don't know if it'll do that or not. We can try it. Oh, no. It, di it would be a hop a dispenser. Okay, that's right. Hopper to a dispenser. Er. But we can at least build that and make it work, and that way I can just, you know, bring the bucket. Actually, we don't. We'll move the lava too. That's what we'll do. We'll just move the lava. That way, it'll just dump everything into the lava for us, and all I have to do is open it and just flush it in there. I think that'll be awesome. So let's do that. I should have enough iron, I think. Maybe. And we're going to build it down here at the bottom of the pit because this is probably where I'm going to be needing it at the most. Because, you know, all the cobble, you know, we're down there digging up stuff. Well, I don't want to have to run all the way upstairs. I mean, you saw how much inventory space I op emptied right there. Look, more than half of my inventory space was emptied just by throwing out the cobble in the dirt, you know. So that'd be great right at the bottom of there at the entrance. We can just come back, dump all the stuff we don't want and keep going mining again. No. Wait a minute. Hold up, hold up. We got some stuff to smelt. Before I, uh, I'm kind of getting sidetracked here. Here we go. So throw that iron ore in there. We're going to throw this gold ore over there. Throw this ventium dust there. And I think that's all we have to smelt. Smelting is completed. Thank you. Let's go. So we'll go downstairs. And we're going to need iron, I believe. Now I have... Being honest, in, in, in the essence of clarity or whatever it is, I have never made a hopper. Ever. Not, 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 I've always played with the hoppers using creative mode. I've never really played with the hoppers using survival. So just being honest with you, telling you what's up, that's the truth. Holy, we got more of that there too. Okay. Oh, we need an iron. So let's grab that eight. See if I can remember how to make them. Nope, that's not it. Hmm. Ooh, I know, I know, I know, I know. Yeah, I made this for th just this reason. Come here, crafting guide. Thank you very much. So we're going to set item. Hopper. Duh! A chest! <laughs> Laugh at me. <laughs> we need a chest. Which means I need to go chop down a tree.
No tree better than this one. That would be the timer. We're going to finish what I'm doing because, you know, I'm not ready to stop yet. Pop it on down there. Mm-hmm. The joys of being a wizard. Look at this. I always hated these trees that had branches. It's not so bad once you're a wizard though. Like it's all of it. I guess we'll find out. Let's go pick up all this wood now. Ha <laughs> ha! Oh man, this stuff went everywhere. Look at this. While oh, we're doing that, plant the next tree. Alright, you gonna die up there? Because, I mean, I didn't miss any blocks, did I? Nope, nope, nope. Doesn't look like it did. Alright, so we got plenty of wood now. Do, 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 do. So head back downstairs. We're going to make our chests. Here's our chest. And so I was close. I had the recipe almost, almost completed. There is our hopper. The next thing we need is a dispenser. Once again, I have not made these things. So, a dispenser. Eh? All right. Well, this one's a little bit easier. Hold on. We can handle that, right? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Seven of those. We need three string. Actually, hold on. We might not need three string. Let's go check the toolbox upstairs. I might already have a bow. I just don't know it. I mean, I kill those things all the time. And there's a bow. So now we need redstone. Redstone. And that should give us... Our dispenser. Oh, and a redstone. There is our dispenser. Da da da. Um, next thing. Oh wait, we're gonna need more than that because the dispenser needs a signal. Ooh. All right. We also need a chest. So let's make another chest here. Might as well. We need a chest to put stuff into. And now we need redstone torches. So we're gonna need. Let's grab. Let's grab four of them, and we're gonna need some actual redstone to take with us, so that's fine. That's and then do, 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 do. I really wanted four sticks, thank you. Four sticks for four redstone for four torches, like that. Now, because we need a timer, even we need to be able to, to, to set it on a timer to go around. Now, I know. We can use uh, repeaters. So, clear. Set item. Repeaters. We need repeaters. Okay. So, torches. Okay. Fair enough. 
And I think we can actually use four of these bad boys. So we're going to need two, four, six, eight torches. And I'm going to need one to get it started. So that's nine torches total. And three, six, twelve pieces of stone. All right. That. Is that eight torches total? Ooh, might as well just do this then. There. There's our eight torches. Now we just need our stone. And let's check on our other stuff here. Oh, look at that. 16, 12. A couple more of that there. We have six there. So these things are great. We found three gold ore and we have six gold ingots so that's a little bit better in fact we could probably make one of those golden apples where's the other gold i think it's still, still downstairs isn't it yes all the gold in the world and i can't make all the apples i want and there is the golden apple. Dun, da, da, da. We'll put this golden apple right back over there. We still need one more golden apple over there. So we'll put this golden ingot in there. Um, so we'll still have to go mining for some more golden apple, golden ore for that. But I think we'll be good there. Shoo. Iron, we can take the iron downstairs. We're not going to need it. Oh, wait, 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 wait. Before I do that. We're going to need that. We are going to need that. And I really need to combi compile all these down, but I'm just not going to do it right now. Go check on our... Oh, wait, 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 wait. They're smelting, so that means that it's... It's doubling out. So, we're not going to need to smelt all six. So this will be a little bit faster than it normally will be because it's doubling it out. That's right, guys. What you just witnessed, let me point out, let me point out what you just saw. You have the ability there we go, to duplicate your cobble in Ars Magica. What you do is you put these things beside a white nexus and then you cook the cobble it will double your cobble because now let's think about it. it it makes it into smooth stone now you place that smooth stone you break it and you have still you know right now if i take these four pieces of smooth stain out and i set them down i break them i'll pick up four pieces of cobble so then i put those four pieces of cobble back into into the arcane front into this the califactor and it'll come out eight pieces of smooth stone place them down you break them you put them back in you'll have 16 and it just doubles over and over again of course it takes time it is a time constrained effort and it, honestly it's much better to just to go mining for it as opposed to trying to duplicate it because i mean you saw how easy it is to mine for it yeah. all right well not too much longer here i'm gonna go ahead and finish this contraption before we leave for the day um so we're just waiting on this right now let's pick that up that's it. We're just waiting on this iron, waiting on the coal, on the cobble over here. And I guess we'll have to say hi to our little neighbor there. Looks like he's coming, walking through our fields. Really? Really? Jeez. Oh, you know, I could have let you just walk into that over there. Mm. Sorry. Yeah, you're still smelting away. Two more. Do, 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 do. All clear. Good, good, good. No. 
Guys, I, I, I distinctly remember there being more of you in, in the fence. Yes, there was. I'm, I'm telling you, don't, you know. Really? Look, there were more of you. I know it. I know I put more of you. In fact, I'm pretty sure I had left five of you in there. So two of you have escaped. Any of you know where they are? No, of course you don't. Uh, of course not. You're not talking, huh? In fact, you're going to send this guy over here. Hi. You following? Come on. It was an ambush. I know. I'm sorry. <laughs> it was an ambush. You was ambushed. We just got one more to cook, and then we'd be done, I think. Oh, I do think. Oh, wait. One of them got tripled. Yay. Not that it matters. It's more important on these things, like iron and gold. Right now, gold. Let's take out this Hecate. You see him? Let me, let me show you. It, in case you haven't seen my other videos... Maybe you see what was wrong with this Hecate. If you notice, he doesn't effing move. He just stands there. He doesn't do anything. He doesn't attack you. He doesn't move. He doesn't despawn. He's annoying is what he is. You can just walk up to him and just very simply just get some free hits in. Take him out just that easy okay it looks like our smelter is done our calefactor so we have all that let's go excuse me sir I'm kind of busy all right so now we need one There's four of those. Okay, so we have just about everything we need to set up with. Oh, we need one more, one more torch. Now this is the kick, kickstart it. This is the kickstarter torch. Is what I want, I pretty much call it, because it kickstarts the timer. All right. Back over here to our mine, where we're gonna finish this bad boy off. Are you following? Come on. I got something right over here for you. Come on, come on, come on. Thank you very much. Thank you. Thank you very much. Oh. Damn, it's hard to navigate one handed while you're drinking a beer. That is very dangerous. Kids, don't try this at home. All right, so we're gonna bring this. You know what? I'm gonna set it. Right, I'm gonna set it up right here. That I think this sounds like a good place to do it. We're gonna grab that bucket. Move some stuff out of the way here. This looks like about center. What do you think? Yeah, about right there. So I'm gonna come over here. I'm gonna go grab lava right there and let's fill that hole in because eh, I don't like leaving flowing stuff around I'm going to take this lava bucket and we're going to pour it right in there now to help me build put that there now we need right down here a dispenser but we need this dispenser facing down that's what we need so hold on let's, let's shot over there so let's do that Doo -doo -doo. there we go show you how we do this I don't fall in there 
Grab that dispenser, throw it up right up there. No. No, I don't think you were looking in the right direction. You are not looking in the right direction, sir. All right, fine. Oh, you punk. Thank you. Now we need to add a redstone signal to that, I believe. And to do that, we're going to pop this out right here. We're going to pull the redstone from there. And we're bring it down right over here. Now this is where we're going to come in to play with the repeaters here. I'm going to hook them up just like this. All right. Now, see, we don't want it going too fast because if you have this going too fast, it'll die out. It'll it it does what they call burnout. So that's why I slowed it down just like that. So this way, if you if we throw a couple things in here now, hold on. Excellent. Let's throw a couple more things in there. Now it has no choice of where it wants to go, so it's just going to plop right on in there. Uh, we don't need this up here anymore, so we can pop this on out of there. And jump on up here and let's grab our hopper, put right there, and we're going to put our chest right on top of that. Just like that. Bada bing! And we need to be able to access this chest. We can't just have it way up there like... Oh my god, we can't get to it, you know? So that's what we're going to start building around it. Because, you know, we don't care. We just need to be able to get up there to dump our cobble. So here, let's let's show it show you show you the thing in action. That's what we need to do. Yeah, I need to block that in too. So, we need some more power. Seriously, that was just silly of me. Whoa. Well, that's weird. I'm not supposed to walk into the wall like that. Hey. How do you do that? Is that part of the mod? Nope. Not at all. All right. So I'm going to block this over here in, so I'm not tempted to accidentally break it. We don't want to put a block right there, because that will break the connection. Yeah, I'll put a block right there. Seriously? Seriously? Oh, did I? Oops. I just said I didn't want to do it, and then I did it. Uh -huh. That's what I want to do all the way around so you can get up to it, you know? Okay, not maybe not all the way around, but most of the way around. I want to be able to get up to it. Just 
Just like that. All right. So I'm going to take the rest of this cobble and we're going to throw it in there. As you see, it's already pulling it out and putting it into the dispenser. And the dispenser is dropping it down in there for us. So we are good to go. We have an automatic destruction box is pretty much what I call it. Also known as a garbage disposal. All right, so that's going to be it for the show. As always, just a like, comment, share. It lets me know that you care. Thank you guys so much for watching. We'll see you in the next, see you in the next episode. Bye-bye.